Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So in this video I will show you a simple way on how to install a, a utility that will allow you to monitor or track cryptocurrencies in Linux. So are you ready? Let's get started. Okay, so the name of this actually a program or utility is called Cointop. It's available, of course, in GitHub. So here, the main page in GitHub. So if you want to install it, so here, for example, you get uh, this. Uh, it's actually a terminal application. If you want to install it, you just go to the table of contents here and you go to install. Okay. And here in the docs, you will get actually how you can install it depending on your distribution actually it's based not it's based but it's uh, actually inspired from htop if you don't know htop let me show you here in the terminal so htop is a utility that will allows you actually to monitor your system so here for example you have how many cpus or, or cores in your system the utilization the memory and all the processes that are running and there are a lot of shortcuts that you can use in order to actually customize this utility so i will quit it using the q command and i will return back to our coin top to show you how you can install it depending on your distribution okay so of course you can install it on mac or any distribution of linux so me i'm using actually red hat so I guess the most convenient way is to use this command here using the DNF package manager. So of course we can install it using snap packages if you want. So let's just copy this line here. So you can use whatever image you want. Okay, so as you can see here, the installation is complete. So we are using now coin type version 1.6.3. So let's launch it to see. Here we go. So we have this uh, terminal interface. Okay. So at the top, you can see the evolution of the Bitcoin because here we are selecting the Bitcoin by default so here the evolution of the Bitcoin values over the year here okay so of course here you can use the up and down key to navigate between the different uh, actually cryptocurrencies so for example let's focus on the first row here which is Bitcoin so here you can see the name the symbol the price okay right now and here the evolution for the last hour the evolution for the last four hours and the evolution for the last days okay and here also one of the most interesting things at the end that you will find is the update time okay so of course you can uh, use here the shortcuts so for example here lowercase r in order to sort this column here so if i type lowercase r it goes from ascending order okay if i hit once again now the descending ascending order okay the same things apply to the name columns 
you can sort it by using the name lowercase n so here you can see RV Algorand so there's a lot of cryptocurrencies that you can choose from okay and uh, of course you can also use the same shortcut if you are using VI or VEM editor in Linux for example forward slash and type here your cryptocurrency Bitcoin enter et voila you get your chosen cryptocurrencies highlighted in your terminal okay so this is a pretty pretty nice utility that you can use in order to monitor your cryptocurrencies okay but if you don't want to use this uh, actually uh, terminal you can just go to your web browser type Bitcoin in Google search and you will get actually a web page so here if I type coin type you get here a link to this web page where you have the same things but this time using just your browser you don't need any terminal or install anything you have a live view of all the cryptocurrencies value in real time okay so you can choose whatever you want you can use your mouse in order to select any cryptocurrency you want so here we have bitcoin ethereum which is very famous also stellar yes stellar is also very famous cryptocurrency anyway so that was just a brief uh, tutorial to show you this utility here that will allows you to monitor and to track all your cryptocurrencies in real time. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye bye.